हेलो आई एम डॉक्टर राजेंद्र गुजल नवर आई एम ए एच ओ डी एंड सीनियर कंसल्टेंट ऑफ प्लास्ट डिपार्टमेंट ऑफ प्लास्टिक सर्जरी एट साकरा वर्ल्ड हॉस्पिटल बैंगलोर टुडे आई एम गोइंग टू डिस्कस अबाउट अ ब्रेक प्लेक्सिस इंजुरीज दीज आर अ कॉमन इंजुरीज वी सी डे टू डे प्रैक्टिस एंड ब्रेक प्लेक्सिस इज अ ग्रुप ऑफ और अ कॉम्प्लेक्स नेटवर्क ऑफ अ नर्स विच कम्स फ्रॉम द स्पाइन Uh, crossing across the neck shoulder and it supplies all the muscles of the upper limb hand forearm arm and the shoulder helps in a movement of these parts whenever there is injury to this part this uh, um, network of nerves results in a paralysis either complete or a partially paralysis of the upper limb we commonly see these injuries in a two types of a uh, patients one uh, is called a obstetric brachial plexus where we see it in the baby born there is a stretching of the nerves during a birth resulting in the, this type of a uh, injuries other one we commonly see during a uh, accidents where there is patient stretch neck and the shoulder stretches and there is a uh, uh, disconnection between the nerves what happens when when there is a brachial plexus injury whenever there is a brachial plexus injury patient is unable to move his shoulder arm elbow and a hand resulting in a complete paralysis of the limb this cripples the the patient and he his affects the day to day activities the treatment includes it's a multidisciplinary treatment involving a plastic surgeon physiotherapy occupation therapist and a psychologist treatment is to be done as early as possible usually we wait first 2 to 3 months so that we see if there is an improvement if there is no improvement we directly uh, offer a surgery surgeries in terms of a nerve repair nerve transfer muscle transfer tendon transfers uh, and post surgically patient will go through the rigorous physiotherapy and results are good if we do intervene at a right time and a right procedure thank you